This is a quick look at how the geometry was developed for the Skokie Greenhouse Project. We were working with an existing building at the intersection of Old Orchard Road and Skokie Boulevard. The massing is pretty unique. It's made up of a sweeping gable roof along a curved path, bookended by two towers. We wanted to capitalize on the existing geometry by revitalizing the curved facade along the street front and reinforcing the tower elements as bookends. Shown here is the curved facade drawn in plan view, extruded up to the underside of the roof, and a second curve drawn in elevation that will be used to cut through the curved facade. The resulting geometry after the two curves are intersected and cleaned up is this double curved surface. The next step was to add a sweeping gradient pleated texture. And this was done in linear segments that were eventually smoothed and lofted to create the morphing effect of a pleated surface at the center of the arc and a flattened surface at the edge of the arc. The result is a lifted curtain effect created by a flattened surface at the edge of the arc and a pleated surface at the center of the arc. The next step was to translate this morphing geometry from the 3D model to two-dimensional design drawings. And to do that, we used a flat plane rotated perpendicular to the curved facade to intersect the morphing surface and highlight the profile at each of these intersections. Each one of these planes is a two-dimensional drawing that's used to convey the profile information to the fabricator. They will then template and cut each block of foam that will receive a unique label for the overall installation. This is a quick look at the design drawing for framing the curve in plan and elevation view locating the updated curve off the existing facade in 16 inch segments for the framers and highlighting the height of the arc every 16 inches as it relates to the elevation. Shown here is an example of our working drawing with wall section cuts along the curved facade and dimensions for each unique profile. and detailed views showcase additional framing at each profile cut. Obviously, 3D modeling tools are paramount to the success of any complex geometry project. But by understanding principles of geometry and using these simple techniques, we were able to communicate this complex form to the fabricator in an efficient and effective way for our construction purposes. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for upcoming projects with unique geometry and helpful fabrication drawing techniques.